You know the deal. 5.30 in the morning. Headed to Los Angeles. Motherfucking California. So we stopped by one of the coolest coffee shops, I think, just cause like this, all this area over here, pretty cool backyard and stuff like that. So gonna drink this coffee, get a little oatmeal on me and uh, go ride a skate park. Exactly what I came down to do. It's pretty cold. I should have brought a, like it's not cold to normal people, but for me, it's fucking cold. This is my third time coming to the skate park. I usually come early in the morning around the same time. But uh, right now the gates are locked and I'm looking at the sign and it says it doesn't open until 10.30, the park doesn't open until 10.30. But I've been here multiple times, well, three times at 7.30 and it's 7.30 now. So I don't know what the hell's going on. There's a dude cleaning it over there. So I don't know if I should ask him if he could open the gate or I don't, I don't know, I'm kind of stuck right now. That was a major, major, major fail. I just talked to the community center Parks and Rec guy and he said he's opening after 10. Oh shit, okay. So the dude is actually really cool. He said he's gonna open the skate park for me. Uh, I can't park in there, but he's opened the gate for me to go get my bike and ride. But uh, that's gonna be half the mission is to find a fucking parking spot because the skate park has a parking lot already. So that marks up my 20 to 30 minutes here at the skate park. Now I gotta get in the van and head 30 miles. So if you guys don't know that, eight o'clock on a Friday, it's a major rush hour, so it's probably gonna be an hour and a half to do 30 miles. So it is what it is. I got a session I've been fiending to ride so bad because you know, running a shop, you don't really have much time. You either get a ride like now or later on at night, but you, you guys gotta make it work, you know what I mean? So, and at night I'm editing these videos for you guys because you know, I want to do that. Super stoked, man. I really, really want to move to LA. Just like, this, like all the parks and just everything, the street and everything. Like, there's so many, so much more options to do out here in LA. I lived out here at the OSS house with Adam and Alfredo, Stevie, and all those dudes. And like, that was probably the best time because we just nonstop rode. And I know there's a lot of BMX riders in Long Beach, but I, I, to be honest, I don't really ride with a bunch of them. I don't. I just, just we're just on different schedules and stuff. If you guys don't notice, I ride alone a lot. But uh, yeah, there's just so much street and just so much more to do in LA. So I'm, I, I wanna make the move out here in the next six to six to uh, six months to a year. And uh, we'll see if that happens. I know it's gonna be hard having a shop and stuff, but hopefully we get this popping. Hopefully you guys go to goldendaysbikeco.com and support the cause and you now we can make it work. And I'm calling Steve Woodward out because he's coming out here in a couple weeks, I believe, Ryan Mills told me. And I want him to over ice pick that wall or anything on that wall, maybe a fufanu, an ice pick. I got dinner and a beer for Steve Woodward if he gets that, that over ice, because he's a master at that trick. Ah, broke the sweat. Now we gotta go throwing bikes. Throwing bicycles? Throwing cycles? We just gotta go throwing. We here at Throne. What's this place? IS Distributed? What is it? Yeah, Innovative Sports Distribution. Innovative Sports distri Distribution. We're here. Well, I like to call it Throne, because we're here to get some throwing bikes. Look at there's there's our van. There's Golden Days van. And look at look at look at their van, bro. Look at we we need to step this shit up. Damn, look at. Damn, got the logo on it. Look at these rims. Damn. So what's this van for? Uh, this is for like our deliveries and our team, the goons. This, we travel city to city, all the West Coast. Hopefully, we're gonna hit the East Coast. First, we're gonna start a ride off at Golden Days. Hey, there we go. Uh, Jason, um, the marketing manager for Innovative Sports, also for team manager for the Throne Track Team and the Goons. There we go. 
Come through, man. There we go. Ooh. What's this? Yeah, so this is our uh, showroom. Uh, we, we love bikes, see? So we have parts galore. Try to, you know, cater to every, almost every bike uh, there is, hope, except for mountain bikes. Okay, is this potential for like uh, potential customers that you sell to shops though they get to look at everything? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like uh, for instance for you, if you needed like, you know, just came in to get some tubes or something, but you need locks, you know, chain breaker, allen keys, stems, chains, tubes. This is smart. It's way better than like looking at a book and, and doing it like this is way better. Yeah, yeah. A lot of people like the, you know, the up close, you know, with their hands type stuff. Yeah. Um, Let's go to Sherman. Cool. I wanted to get some of these. This is uh, Ike. This is Nate Richard. This is the boss. How you doing? How you doing? What do you do here? H to Z. <laughs> he does everything. Damn, who's this ball from? Oh, that's Shaq and Kobe. Oh, Shaq and Kobe? Yeah. Okay, okay. Second story. Hello, Norma. Morning. Hello. Hey, good morning. Oh, this is awesome. This bad boy, you're gonna be able to find these at Golden Days. Yeah. Long Beach. I like these a lot. What was the whole design? Did you have any part in designing these ones? Not these ones, but the next ones that are coming out, we do, I did. Um, Hansel, uh, which works at Link Customs now. He's the one that did all the graphic work, you know, like uh, the designing of everything. All of the, everything. Like the design, the throne. The logo, that logo, that logo. All this stuff? Everything in You know what's crazy is that Fat Boy, I did a huge ad for Fat Boy. For real? Yeah, I got paid 150 bucks for like uh, to do shoot a photo with them. And it was at Interbike like a few years ago. It's massive. That's funny. Yeah, I was doing a Smith grind. I shot it with the homie. You know, we try to be affordable, but yeah, good price. Yeah. Uh, parts and stuff for kids and stuff. Where are the bikes made? Uh, overseas. Overseas, okay. LA is always it's always mostly summer time. Yeah. Sure. So we have to stack up on like some uh, beach, cruisers. beach cruisers. Oh, these are cool. Yeah, and then the three speed, seven speed, single speed. Um, these more like your your simple classic look, which is bike called. And then the Cobra is like more of a big wheel tire cruiser type thing, you know, like you want to cruise the beach and check out all the girls when we get when we get more popping we're, i'm gonna have to get some of these back downstairs golden cycles there you go <laughs> who's that let's collab yeah. <laughs> easy collab <laughs> yo but hey your boy you need to make a no jumper goon Hey, that'd that should, be fire. That should look hard. Yeah, hell yeah. What is this? So basically, it is easy. Yeah. Um, uh, like this. Everything in here are pretty much thrown on our track. I mean, shit, dude. This is bikes on racks on racks on racks. How many bikes do you guys usually carry here? Do you know? Fuck, I don't know, dude. Uh, <laughs> thousands? There's like sometimes, uh, depending on the container, like sometimes like four something bikes will come in here. But then, I don't know, dude. That's that's a, that's like a safety hazard, probably. <laughs> yeah, OSHA. Yeah. Don't tell OSHA. <laughs> Block. Working hard. Working hard. I joined a gang today, guys. Let's show it. I joined a gang. Two wheel gang. It's always been gang, but two wheel gang today. Yep. Shout out to Block Boy Fame. Hey. The homie. What uh? What riders? Do you have any local riders out here in California? Oh, dude, with the goons. Yes. Black Boy Fame, Sea Breezy, DZ Bike Life, what else? Uh, Wuda, Trill. Oh man, we got a squad. We got people up in the Bay. Jake Lonitz, Jake Santos, ODZ, uh, Slim Boy. Yeah, we got a gang. That's what I'm saying. Where can uh, people find you if you guys like for a road trip or whatever, your product? Oh man, follow us on Instagram, uh, Throne Cycles, or uh, go to thronecycles.com and we'll keep you up to date on the 2020 tour is gonna be fucking lit. There we go. Hey. These bikes going all around the country or around the world? Around the world. Around the world? Around the world. Oh, go. Look, already ready to go. Yee. Three bikes.
I want to give a big shout out to Jason over here at Throne Cycles. Super stoked to have these bikes in there. If you guys want to know some more about Throne, just hit their Instagram up, follow them. And uh, if you guys want to buy one, come test ride one. Come to Golden Days. We got you, 3328 East Anaheim. Time to go to the shop. I think that's going to be the end of this video. Thank you guys for watching the vlog. Stay tuned, baby. Let's go.